Hello and welcome to One Piece Nation News. The first subject today is Bleach, and yes, the Bleach manga has been confirmed in Volume 73 that it will be ending in Volume 74. Due to the amount of chapters in each volume of Bleach, unless the final volume is extra long, assuming it is a regular length volume, Bleach only has 5 or 6 chapters remaining. I am assuming 5 chapters. I will be reviewing those final 5 chapters, but this is very devastating news for the main fact that, uh, this is so I am personally being affected by this. The reason this news is devastating is because there's not enough time. The Bleach ending is most likely going to be garbage, it's going to be rushed as hell, and it's going to be really bad. But, let's move on to the next piece of our news, because there isn't really much to say about this. The time for Bleach is ending in five chapters, just like Naruto. I'm not happy, you're not happy, nobody's happy about this, because it just means we're going to get a bad written ending, and a very rushed ending, and it's not going to be pretty, but whatever. Let's move on to the next piece of news. April 7th, 2013, the first episode of the Attack on Titan anime aired in Japan, and the series exploded. Now, in 2016, we have finally gotten the release date of the second season. Thanks to a, a report and article by Anime News Network, we know that the second season of Attack on Titan will premiere in 2017, during spring. Now, unfortunately, there is some bad news, and that's mainly about the fandom, alright? Attack on Titan was immensely popular in 2013, and for the majority of 2014. However, the almost four-year wait killed the hype. Nobody talked about season two anymore, because nobody really cared. It is very unfortunate, but the interest has pretty much gone away. A lot of people are probably going to watch it, and it's probably going to do really well. But people, I am not, like, with, with the previous announcement about Bleach ending. Okay, let's just say those videos, there are videos all over YouTube instantly, alright? That was everywhere, and that news blew up. This did not blow up. This has barely been talked about. It will probably be talked about more. But nobody is hyped enough about it to drop whatever they're doing to make videos on it. They're waiting until they have time. So this is unfortunate, but there's not a lot of hype for this at the moment. But I did want to confirm that Attack on Titan Season 2 will be premiering in Spring 2017. In Dragon Ball news, the translation of the Dragon Ball Super manga has begun. In fact, if you check this media website, you will see they have already translated the first two chapters as of the recording of this video. This news was dropped by Condensu on July 1st. So check out my link to Condensu, as well as all the other links that will be linking you to the article where all of this information was confirmed on Anime News Network and Condensu. The super manga being translated had nothing to do with the Funimation dub. There is no update on the Funimation dub. I will bring you that news as as soon as it comes out, I mean, I want to see that too, but as of the moment, that is really it. At the end of One Piece Chapter 831, we were told there would be no chapter this week, meaning on third day this week, we will not be getting a One Piece Chapter. That doesn't really mean much for me, it just means that Oda is going on another break, but I will probably do a live stream this Thursday. I'm not sure what time, I'm thinking 8 a.m. at night, I'm thinking maybe 8 a.m. Maybe. Not confirming anything, but I may do a live stream. No One Piece chapter this week, in case you were unaware. Hope you guys enjoyed the new video. If you want more videos like this, leave it a like. Uh, remember to comment your thoughts on all this news down below. And above all else, guys, have a great day. This is One Piece Nation, signing out. And by the way, can you subscribe?